They're off. Over six furlongs for the Kegel family handicap. Pockley a little bit slow to go. Golden Apollo wasn't the best away. Good fast start by Speedicus in the cheek pieces. Also away well. Bossy pop out wide. A up it's the boss in the green and yellow to the inside. Corinthia Knight, the course specialist, is prominent in the yellow and white. Out deep Cottom Lane is next, followed by Haymaker. Centre pack Pockley makes up ground, racing in front of Abitha Rocks and then Churchill Bay to the inside. It just takes time towards the back of the field and Golden Apollo will have to pass them all to win. Up the hill they come back towards the final three furlongs. They're passing halfway. Bossy pop in the silver and red towards the inside Speedicus in the cheek pieces Cottom Lane out wide, Red Sleeves White Armlet starts to pick up, Haymakers right there in the red and yellow, Corinthian Knight is next, Pockley improving behind with a pink cop, a pink cap and then I, a, up it's the boss behind that one, up the hill they come inside the final two now then Bossy Pop tackled by Haymaker towards the far side trying to stay with them Speedicus, Cottom Lane tries to go over the top Pockley's looking for room, Golden Apollo from miles back is beginning to blast home in the centre, Golden Apollo's coming fast and late and so to it just takes time from nowhere, Golden Apollo and it just takes time, settle down to fight it out, Golden Apollo all out Golden Apollo wins the finale so it just takes time, Haymaker next, Pockley gallant fourth in front of Cottom Lane and behind that one was uh, Ibiza Rocks Thank you. Faye has just rode Cottom Lane at Pontefract. What's your thoughts? Uh, I'm so happy with him today. The tongue tie made a massive difference because he picked up and found a second wind. I'd say the draw just slightly got us beat as well because we were caught wide. I've had to ask him a little bit sooner rather than later because obviously you don't want to take him back and disappoint him. So I've asked him and he's picked up and picked up but then he just couldn't sustain it at that speed. There's so much pace on today that everyone's slitted, like slitted throats up front. Also the, the weather we <laughs> turned against us uh, a couple of races it just started to uh, pour down which uh, it's not got into much but obviously when he's trying to pick up he ends up just wheel spinning because the ground has got a little bit on the sort of side so but I'm really happy with him and I hopefully he'll uh, come out of this race well and we'll be much nearer next time. Thanks for letting me ride him.